Breaking the Wall of Personal Health Monitoring. Emra Ozan Polat, the Institute of Photonic Sciences, Spain. Okay, hi everyone. Today I will talk about uh, personal health monitoring. So I would like to start by mentioning some common problems in public health. Uh, so, according to the latest report of the World Health Organization, at least 400 million people do not have any access to essential healthcare ser services. So, that might be due to the uh, remote areas that doesn't have any hospital, or poverty, of course, or reduced mobility of the individual. <clears throat> I think the second problem is also lacking of uh, active tracking of public health, which, pre which uh, plays a key, key role to prevent common diseases such as hypertension and heart diseases. And all of us know from our daily lives that uh, late diagnosis and the poor medical control of the individual puts a barrier uh, over a high level of uh, public health. So, so, so the point is, uh, there has been no common solution to address all of these three problems. But now, in Barcelona, we are, we are developing smart medical patches. So imagine a medical flaster that you can attach on your skin and extract medical information about yourself. So actually, I'm wearing one of the devices on my skin, and thanks to the quantum materials used in the sensor, these are totally f transparent and flexible, and they operate with a very low power consumption. So what's, what's good about these sensors are they can, they can connect to your s f uh, smart device or even to the healthcare provider, which would enable the active tracking of public health. So we have some prototypes uh, like, like this in the lab. We are, we are able to measure heart rate and oxygen saturation in a very high accuracy, and we are adding up many more vital signs such as hydration, temperature, breathe rate, and UV monitoring. So uh, as I said, we have prototypes, and with the mass production of these devices, since they are using like plastics, uh, they are really cheap. They, the, the device goes, le goes less than a euro, which is literally free. And with the, with the distribution over large amount of people, uh, we, believe that, we believe that that can actually uh, enable uh, the active tracking of public health, especially for the uh, developing countries. Uh, so we believe that personal wellness is a human right which should be totally free and easily accessible. Thank you very much.